this morning I am hanging in. I refuse to rush out and be about the daily activities. This is my time on a Friday morning about 9 o'clock. I am outside repotting my plants. That's something I like to do. But as I was sitting down on my porch, you know, doing what I'm doing, repotting my plants. I live in the hood. Uh, you know, I've been there, done that. Been on the alcohol, the drugs. Whatever is involved in that inner city hood life. I'm an 80s baby, been there, done that, okay? So, a lady about my age walking by. You know, I guess they uh, selling stuff to get drugs. So they're, uh, you know, selling DVDs, stuff they done collected up. So she was with another lady about the same age as I am, 50-ish. Now, I would assume sooner or later, come on, people, come on. But anyway, they were... Uh, stopping me and soliciting the items they had but um you know I, I I'm, I'm in my time so I didn't shun them away or anything but I contributed five dollars to something just you know because I've been there done that so um they left here went back down the street towards the liquor store and everything one of the ladies came back Screaming and hollering on the sidewalk, walking back this way. And I found myself, I was in that position too. I went to jail the, day, the time I did it. I went to casting out devils and the devil is a, all of this kind of stuff. I was drunk in the middle of the road like no car can't hit me. Police have sworn me. I got Baker Act. <laughs> but, so, I see this lady in the same situation attitude, feeling, emotion that I felt. She was screaming and hollering, nobody's your friend. I'm the one stupid. I'm stupid. <laughs> and I, I know what she feeling like. You know, this world don't care about you. They using you. You done did your hustling to help this woman sell this stuff. And you didn't get a dime or you didn't get even get a beer or or a uh, uh, Nick or whatever the case may be. <laughs> Excuse me. But she's stomping down the road. You know, I'm still on my porch planting in the dirt and everything. And I'm hearing her say things that I said back in my day. Now, I was what? 30-ish. But, okay, this like 20 years ago. She 50-ish. So I heard her she and I almost said at the same time, I say, wake up, sister. Wake to myself. You know, I didn't tell her that, but to myself, I say, wake up, sister. And as she got further down the road, I heard her say, I need to wake up. I'm the one stupid. And I was like, there you go, Father. Thank you. Wake up, sister. I agree with you. Wake up. Come on, people. It come a time when we're a child. We do childish things. We living squanderous. You know, we we taking advantage of our privileges, of our inheritance. We just squandering with the pigs. We young. We don't know no better. Get the energy out. Do what you're going to do. Do it young. But come on. When I was a child, I thought I was a child. Now that I'm an adult, I put away childish things. We 50, 60, whatever years old, and we still participating in this dope, this alcohol, this wildlife. You're killing yourself. You're killing yourself. I'm quite sure you done made visits to the doctor and they're telling you different results. What, what, what? Leave it alone. It's a life. Don't let that be your whole life. You've given your life up. We don't have to give up. There is hope. There is a way out. Get out. And the first way to get out to me, or that I found to be truth, start watching what comes out of your mouth. 
speak a victorious, conquered, victory confession. Don't speak defeat. Anytime you hear out of your mouth something negative, stop it. Cut it out. Dig those roots up and start planting good seed. I am delivered. I am non-alcoholic. I am off crack. I am off whatever drugs they got out there. I am drug free. I am start speaking confessions of positive. Your words are condemning you. By your words you're speaking life or death. There is a way to get out. Come out from amongst this stuff. Separate yourself. First start with the words you're speaking out of your mouth. Then start separating yourself physically, emotionally. And watch your life change.